welcome to another Electric Gigi's tutorial, video, whatever you want to call it, cooking, demonstration. I'm going to do something a little different this time. This is a non-talking video, so I'm just going to go ahead and lay the foundation in the beginning right now. I made homemade soup today. So with the homemade soup, you can add any vegetables that you want. The vegetables that I added was zucchini, red onion, red pepper, uh, mushrooms and um, a tomato based sauce with the tomato based sauce is very simple and I put the instructions up as well and I have to do the video on the tomato based sauce but the tomato based sauce is just the the base sauce and you can use it for anything you can use and add different seasonings to make it like an Italian base or you can make ketchup from it you can just do everything just by the basic tomato based sauce so the tomato based sauce is just tomatoes and um, a half an onion and um, sea salt and onion powder. And that's all I put in my the base of my tomato the, the, for just the basic tomato based sauce with no other seasonings in it. I put it in my Vitamix, turn it on, get everything mixed real well. And then I stop it. I st well, this time I stopped, you know, after it, it was mixed up real well. I went ahead and added some fresh basil leaves in it just to give it a little taste because I wanted my soup to have to be real, you know, full of flavor. So that was the tomato base. So um, you'll see as you know, you watch the video, the instructions on how to do the tomato base and the stuff that I use for um, the soup. You can use, like I said, you can use any vegetables that you want in your soup and it should come out fantastic with a tomato based sauce and some water. So like I said, just watch the video, get some ideas on how to make the soup, and then just take it from there, add your own vegetables that you want. And you can do this on the stove top with a crock pot, like the really big like stew pot, or you can do it in a, well, did I say crock pot on the stove top? I am so sorry. I mean, you can use a cast iron pot, the big one like cooking stew, to cook your soup in. Or you can use a crock pot, put the stuff on in the morning, and then, you know, if it's, it has a timer on it, you can just set it on low or four hours or, or for eight hours, and that cooks slower. And then when you get home, you have homemade soup. So it just depends on the type of crock pot you have. Now, the soup that I did make, it yields a lot. So I did use a very large, you know, the, the larger crock pots, the larger crock pot. So, like I said, it yields a lot, but it's really good. You can even add like garbanzo beans in there. You can add quinoa in there. The possibilities are endless. You can even add like chopped okra. So there's all types of vegetables that you can use inside of your soup. So I hope you enjoy the video and then you don't get to see me anymore or hear my voice anymore. Yay! But um, anyway, so enjoy.